Kelly Schaefer down in Orlando, Florida for a baseball winter meetings and I'm here with Scott. Scott, welcome. We're uh, reporting for Loons.com and we are here at his uh, uh, site over here and pleased to welcome you and, and, and meet you. Um, and tell us a little bit about your uh, mobile thing or network that we're uh, Sure, the, uh, we develop mobile apps for, for minor league baseball, major league baseball teams. Uh, it's an app designed for fans to enhance the fan experience in the state. It uh, provides uh, access to statistics, standings, rosters, promotions, uh, schedule, shop, buy tickets, uh, pretty much everything a fan needs. And your platform is a little bit of everything, but iPhone and Android are, are two that I know are, are up and coming. And uh, a lot of interactive things I'm hearing too, with potentially programs, and uh, I've seen a lot of those scanning things that you have in the program, and you'll be able to go live to the to the site as well. Correct. So uh, QR codes. Okay. So okay. QR codes, for those who don't know, is a funky little Aztec type bar barcodes that you see in the Target and Best Buy. Um, they're interactive, so you scan what's on a static um, static program. Because you interact with information, so a video or statistics, it takes you to a website or some sponsor information. Um, we are doing iPhone, iPad, and Android. So, what other kind of fun um, apps and things will I see as a user at, on my iPhone that I can pick through with and see? Sure, uh, social media is big, so your Facebook and Twitter and YouTube feeds. As far as interactions, it depends on the team. So, some teams have a mascot race, so you allow the fans to vote on the mascots. So Guess the attendance at the stadium. So, really, it's just uh, it's, it's whatever the teams can come up with. Oh, good. Well, I'm excited to uh, see it hopefully in 2011, it sounds like.